Welcome back to Geeking Out, everyone. Uh, it's been a couple of weeks since I posted anything. I've been out of, on vacation. But I got quite a bit done earlier. Um, and it's been pretty tough because it's been super hot here. Uh, at any rate, I'm going to go over some of the things that I've got done. Really, it's mainly the lift system that I've gotten uh, pseudo working. And I'll explain what I've got left to do on that. But let's take a look. What you can see is it's a cabling mechanism with um, a threaded rod basically an acme screw there at the top and you can see the the chain going down to a turning mechanism and believe it or not that is an old um, bicycle hub or, or gear and sprocket whatnot off of a hub and I'll Show that a little more detail a little bit later on. At any rate, the thought was when you turn that bicycle uh, gear, it would push the uh, threaded rod or get the, the nut going back and forth against the threaded rod, which in turn raises and lowers the uh, head here. And so far, it's working great. I've still got to put in, I've got to take all these pieces off and put some keyways on the shafts so that I can lock these sprockets in place and uh, they'll be positioned right now they're just sort of tightened on there so they they give a little bit but at this point it seems to be working pretty well I've still got a, a bunch of locking down to do as an example I've got to put some more of those uh, nuts on there to tighten those cables down, make sure they stay secured. I'm also going to do a little adjustment to that, that piece right there that the threaded rod is welded on, excuse me, that the threaded nut is welded on to. And I'm probably going to sort of create a rail system so it rides on this rail right here and keeps it a little stationary, a little better. Um, but like I said, at this point, it does work really pleased with that and I'm gonna go over a little detail with you on this this bike mechanism here and show you what I did um, essentially I bought an old mountain bike frame for ten dollars off of Facebook marketplace and uh, this is it right here and I just cut out the as you can see the hub area so that um, right here there it is so I just cut out the hub in the, the sprocket whatnot area grinded it down and then took some uh, took some tubing that I had that where the this tubing would match the inner diameter uh, going in here and welded it up and I'll show you how this works it works really cool let me let me get to a, a set this down and we'll take a look at that all right so you can see what I did here I took and welded cut this piece of tubing here and then welded it on and then put a, uh, a threaded that little hole right there drilled a hole and threaded it out so this, this essentially slips on here like so tighten it down uh, it's a compression fitting and what that allows me to do is take and put the chain on it and tighten it up like so
and we're good to go. That's it. So that had turned out a lot better than I was anticipating. Really pleased with that. I'm probably going to take these uh, these guys here, cut this off here, and uh, weld a screw on, and then 3D print my own handle or whatnot. And I'm probably going to go ahead and do it on the back side too, so that I can turn with both hands potentially. Haven't really uh, finalized that thought. If I don't end up doing that, I can simply cut this off right here and, and call it done. But uh, all in all, the lift mechanism appears to be working pretty well. I'm, I'm pleased with it. So I think that's about it for this video. Uh, as always, if you like these, hit the like, subscribe, and uh, we'll be putting out more here soon. I'm actually going to, I think I'm going to jump to a little bit different video and uh, develop a, a small project that I started years ago. I uh, actually had it working that connects to an Android so that a light blinks here in the shop when uh, my phone's ringing and that way I don't have to worry about uh, um, missing calls or whatnot. So mainly supper's ready. At any rate, thanks for watching. Everybody have a good one and look forward to seeing you again. Oh,